is as the complete process being completed, the elections. Elections are not over. You know, there are disagreements between the major parties and the, the next level is to go to court for adjudication. So nobody can, okay, the uh, professor Yakubu pronounced Bola as the president and gave him certificate in the middle of the night. But my party and some other political parties are still in court. So it's not over. And when it's over, we will weigh the, the pluses, the minuses, and uh, come to a conclusion. But like you said during your introduction, uh, Papa Lucy, apart from being the leader of the, uh, the forum in their party, is like an elder brother to me in Lagos. And traditionally in Yoruba land, if an elder says he wants to come and see you to discuss certain points, you don't throw him away, you don't disrespect him. Because what you do to your elders, you think the younger ones coming behind you will do the same thing to you. Respect to elders is a, is a primus uh, into Paris in our own culture. So when I got the message that um, he sent a word to me that he would like to see me, I asked the, the, uh, my good friend uh, who told me, I said, I hope there is no problem. Why would Papa want to come and see me? Let me let him tell me to come to his house. I'll go there. But he said it was political. I said, oh, political? Okay, why not? So Papa came here. And he told me, you know, in his uh, in unclear terms, that look, buddy, I came here for three issues. Yes, sir. First one, that time he came alone. And he asked the, my friend, Dr. Nero Adeniji, to be a witness. So the three of us sat in my office and said, he came here for three issues. The first one is to apologize to you because of what had happened to you, uh, which, you know, was through uh, uh, Bola. The second issue was that he, he wants us to establish a platform in Lagos where they are, they are irrespective of your political affiliations, you know, you will be will be able to discuss matters that will affect Lagos. So two, three heads, whether you are they are in their political party or not in their political party, you are a Lagosian that will positively impact Lagos will be a major issue. So that was how, that was the second item on the discussion. Then the last one was, he said, look, enough is enough. Uh, he would advise that I should go and pay my, uh, my congratulatory uh, visit to Bola Tinumbu. Ah, immediately, I said, Papa, you know, um, and let me start from where you stopped. I belong to an, another political party, and I'm an irredentist PDP man. Not only that, I am a life member of the board of trustee of the party, and the only one representing this, the, the Southwest in the national caucus of our party. Our party is in court with this gentleman. How would I, how, how do I explain to the party members? How do I explain to my children? How do I explain to my family members? How do I explain to my friends that I would jump the ship and go? I wasn't brought up that way and I will not do it. So he said, okay, we will come back again, bring some more people. So on uh, Saturday or Sunday, this uh, last week, Papa came with uh, the retired Justice Olorunimbe, you know, a 94-year-old man who is also like a big baba to me. Uh, and then there were two other former deputy governors from Lagos State, and they came. 
and he repeated the same issues. On my side, I invited our elders too. This is only Kepo Shudi, Senator Kufu, Rola, Bokno, Akiri Bokno. We invited Dr. Akituye, Dr. Adeniji, and some others, you know, so that they will be participants at the meeting. So they raised the same three issues. The first one to, to come and beg me. And I told Papa in unclear terms that there is nothing personal between me and this gentleman. I have nothing personal. All I disagree with are these uh, 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 methodologies of governance. The, the, his own his own his own ways of managing the resources of the land for the benefit of the people is not impacting on the people. I am a thoroughbred Lagosian. I was born and bred and grew up here. There is so much degradation. Go to my local government. Uh, first of all, the the Femi Bajabi Amila had been here. We had discussions. I told him all the things. I I warned them to do in Lagos. It doesn't matter to me. What matters to me is that let Lagos be like the best city in the world. Make life more meaningful. Impact on the minds of the people positively because the power rests with the people. But if there is nothing rather than that, the method of management, the financial management, completely despicable. So I said to them, I have no qualms, I have no objection 